Hello Movers, welcome back to Move Daily Fitness. Here is a shoulder finisher for you. So maybe you finished an upper body workout. You really want to work on those shoulders. This is such a fantastic burnout finisher just to make sure that all of those muscles are activated. So you're going to be working on your anterior delt, your medial delt, and your posterior delt. All the heads of the shoulder are going to be activated in this final blast. Grab a variety of dumbbells. You'll need those in the workout today. I'm also going to sit for a few of the exercises, so grab a chair or a bench. I won't do a warm up because I'm assuming that you're just going to add this onto an already existing workout. And if you need one, just to add before this, click or tap the card at the top of the screen. That's a great one to add to this little finisher. All right, let's do this and move daily. We're going to start with three exercises. You're going to hit the front head, the medial delt, and the posterior delt. So I'm going to set up my weights right here. I'm going to sit on the last exercise for a little reverse fly. We'll repeat it for three rounds, and then I've got a great little 100 rep burnout for you. I'm starting with eight pound dumbbells. Knees are soft, front raise, palms face the ceiling, stick your chest out. All right, here we go. So you're up, pause, and down. Up. Down, nice and slow. Very good, set those down. Grabbing lighter weights, fives. For my lateral raise there, working my medial delt. Knees are soft, and here we go. Up. Last one here. Good, I'm gonna go back to my eights, have a seat for my seated reverse flies. Chest is on your thighs, dumbbells under your legs like this. And up here, retract your shoulder blades, working those rear delts here. Not to bring your body up. Round two. Back to your front raise. Switch weights if you need. Palms to face the ceiling. Up here, together, and open. All right, I'm gonna stick with eights for my lateral raise, so a little bit heavier. You can stay with fives if you need, or even lighter. Here we go. Good, getting 12 reps in, that's a great rep range. All right, reverse flies. Your chest to your stomach.
All right. Come again. Last round. Again, I'll stick with eights. Palms are up. Stick your chest out. And lift and chest. to medial with your lateral raise. I'm going to stick with eights, knee soft, and pop. Slightly heavier. Hands here for me. Stick your chest out. Up and over. Oh, I grabbed twelves. <laughs> okay. Well, this is good too. Just take my time. Little front. Little medial delt in this exercise. All right, set those down. Moving to a military press. I'm actually going to grab tens for this overhead press. See, so if you'd like. over double wide row, palms face the back of your room, hinge forward at the waist and pull up to 90 degrees. Here we go. Up here, up and pause, working those rear delts again, a little bit of middle back muscle as well, but I want you to put your mind in the back shoulder and pause at the top, feel that muscle contract.
gonna grab eight for the wide rows again. Core engaged, hinge forward. Here we go, pull it wide and pause. Good. You're going to finish off with 100 lateral raises. You can use weights or no weight. I'm going to start with my fives. Okay, you're going to finish off with 100 lateral raises. I'm going to hold fives. Knees are soft. I want you right out to the straight side, right like that. Arms are straight. Soften the elbows if you need, if it's getting challenging, or eliminate the weights. I'll give you 10 seconds of rest in between. Here we go. Up for one, two, three. Four, just follow with me. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Rest for ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and up for one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and twenty rest for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty rest for one, two, three, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty. Rest for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Up for one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifty. Rest for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Up for one, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, sixty. Rest for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Up for one, <clears throat> two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seventy. Rest for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Up for one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, eighty. Rest for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Up for one, two, three. Stay tall. Four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ninety. Rest for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last ten here. Up for ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and done. You move daily, your shoulder burn out. Excellent, swing those arms out. Again, great to do if you wanna build that side shoulder cap, if you want those muscles to pop, let's just bring the arm across. Great way to increase your um, time under tension. You could always, you know, add, you could do 30 reps, increase the weight, do 30 reps, increase the weight. That'd be a great way to make it progressively more challenging for yourself. Uh, you can start with zero weights. Add five weights the next time you try it. Add ten, uh, eight pound weights the next time. Maybe even tens the next time. So as you get stronger and more capable, you increase your, your tension. And that's how you do it. This is how we do it. Like that. All right, everyone. Thanks for joining. That was a great little burnout. I feel the pump in those shoulders. I hope you do as well. Make sure you join me in the next workout. And you can click or tap there for another short finisher. Or right there's another one as well.